We take it for granted. The Earth is a beautiful blue spherical marble set against the blackness of space. But without the recent benefit of going out into space and looking back, someone had to advance the idea that the Earth might be round rather than flat, as it appears to anyone on the ground. According to many accounts, that person was Pythagoras of Samos, a 6th century BCE philosopher, mathematician, and part-time astronomer from Greece, also famous for his Pythagorean theorem in geometry. One evidence that the Earth is round is the curved shadow of the Earth cast onto the Moon during a lunar eclipse, such as the one observed in Greece. The argument Pythagoras and his followers made for a spherical Earth was indirect, based on various observations. For example, sailors travelling south from Greece reported seeing southern constellations higher in the sky the farther south they went. For example, expeditions that departed for destinations along the African coast south of the equator reported that the sun shone from the north rather than from the south as in Greece. Observing lunar eclipses provided another important piece of evidence. When the full moon passes directly behind the Earth relative to the sun, the Earth's curved shape is visible as it eclipses the moon.